Elizabeth Edwards and her daughter Katie were murdered in their own beds, stabbed in the throat and then smothered. The boyfriend and girlfriend who did it were just 14 at the time. This is the Edwards home in Spalding after the murders in April. The boyfriend actually attacked the victims and he admitted two counts of murder. The girlfriend had denied those instead of admitting manslaughter on grounds of diminished responsibility. The court heard that even though she didn't hold the knife, the girl was the driving force behind the murders and that she's shown no remorse. The prosecution said that brutality and contempt ooze from every pore. This is the murder weapon. The court heard how afterwards the teenage couple watched four Twilight vampire films. What makes this case even more shocking is that these two were 14 years of age when they planned, committed these callous, senseless and unprovoked attacks on Elizabeth and Katie. Play again. Play again. No <laughs> Go on. <laughs> Elizabeth Edwards was a much-loved school dinner lady and helped with the local choir and drama group. We had about 18 or 19 children in the choir and she helped with that and again she was brilliant because very organised, very committed, never let me down, great with the children and uh, while I dealt with the music she dealt with crowd control if you know what I mean. So she, she became such a wonderfully committed member of, of St Paul's and you know she was here every week. Relatives sobbed as the judge described this as an exceptional case by any standards. It has been harrowing for everyone involved and one family has been torn apart.